Gibson again. Confirmed yesterday he signed a one-year deal to stay at Salford. We saw him make four appearances last season, but he made a very considerable impact on the team. Two man of the match performances in particular against Newport and Bradford City. Here's the Raukeld looking for Henderson, can't quite find him. And Preston back in possession. Towel intercepts in the middle, drops down for low. Chested down to Henderson, takes it on his left foot. And saved by Ripley. Henderson, who signed a two year extension recently with the Lily Whites, 23 year old former Everton player. He's having his chance to show Alex Neal his potential, but now Salford breaking. Thomas Santi on the right hits a powerful effort. Palms around the post by Ripley. And Salford have the first corner of the game, starting to look more threatening here in the ninth minute. Taken quickly. Low. Turns out to the right for Threlkeld. Back to low now. Rolls the ball out in front of him. Then turns back. Passes to Threlkeld. Goes back to Clark. Closed down by Maguire. Brought down by Henderson. The long pass. 1 2 with low. And he spreads it to the left-hand side. Torre advancing from left-back. Keeps the ball in play. He's got options in the middle. Gets past his man. Breaking into the area and takes the shot himself. Flashes across goal. One of those just needs a touch on it. That's a good height for the forwards too. Ball played forward by Preston. Comes free on the left-hand side. Hughes closed down by Threlkeld. But the loose ball spins in towards the area. Hughes pulls it back, shot comes in low. Just past the post from Bayliss. All season tickets on sale to Salford fans as well. It does include a live access link to stream home games in the league that you won't be able to attend. Whether that will be through our streaming service and not through YouTube and only available at the moment to People with a laptop or desktop computer, unfortunately, due to EFL regulations, it's not available on mobile, tablet or smart TV. Here, Preston looking dangerous and take the lead. Scott Sinclair just had a yard off Jason Lowe there. The ball was trickling around. Salford couldn't clear the lines. And just as he turned, he managed to stab it under where Nick Hayes was. And it's Salford City nil. Preston North End one after just over 20 minutes. Of course, he had those very bad rains. Some clubs left with flooded pitches. Ours didn't quite get that bad, although we did see it underwater a couple of times. Certain mud patches coming up. But Preston on the attack here. Maguire to Johnson. Johnson out to the right hand side. Bowden arriving at the right time. Two assists now for Johnson and two goals for Preston in the last couple of minutes. Salford nil, Preston two. Just need to tighten up here. Preston with a lot of plays forward. Won the ball back. Goes out for a Salford throw on the right. Throw held in field to Gibson. Gets it back. And now he finds Lowe. Gets a shove in the back of Johnson there. But a nice combination with Henderson. Now Lowe comes in from the right. Thomas Sante Trying to put the ball across the back post. Preston taking the time. Throw comes in. Finds Ledson. Loses possession to Lowe, though, in a good area. Onto his right foot, takes the shot, pushed away by Ripley. Henson's there to pick the ball up quickly. Finds Hunter on the half volley. Pulls on back for Salford. A well-taken effort from Ash Hunter. Ian Henderson acknowledging the finish from the winger. He always seems to pick up the second balls in the area. Now with a goal-scoring record like his, got to be in the right places. So he was there, as was Hunter, and clinical. Salford with a three-man wall. It's Brown, right-footed. Lines up the shot, which is cleared by Brandon Thomas Asante. It collided with his face. Preston play it back forward. It's flicked on. Maguire's got three of his man. He's offside, though, as he puts the ball past Hayes. Maybe it's Salford's relief in the 44th minute. Will be a free kick. For the enemies. Played short this time. Hunter swings it in. It's off the crossbar from, I think, Patrick Bauer with the last touch on that one. It's gone behind for another Salford corner. Slight change up there from the usual routine. Salford clear. 
Threlkeld picks out Andrade, playing very centrally here. Plays it through, it's behind Tom Sassante, just in front of Hunter. The clearance is controlled by Turnbull. Picks out Towell on the left-hand side. Barge down by Pearson. Not enough in it for the referee. Pearson streaming forward. Potts on the overlap. Stockley at the back post arriving. Potts does get the cross in. And it's tapped in by Preston. And the player out on the overlap there. Behind Stockley. And unmarked. Gets a simple tap in. Makes it 3-1 to Preston. Hunter. Might fancy this one himself. Has got options in the middle. Preston physically and height-wise a lot taller than Salford. So Hunter on his right foot. Does curl it towards the back post. Turnbull gets up. Can only hand the ball over into the west stand. Threlkel's coming forward from the right. Maybe there's a flourish to finish. Hawkins back to towel. Looking up to the air as he floats the ball in. But it's confident goalkeeping from... Hudson comes out and claims that at the top of the area. That takes us to 90 minutes and on cue, there is the full-time whistle. It's finished Salford City 1, Preston North End 3. That late goal from substitute Josh Harrop sealing the deal for the Lily Whites. That's um, victory for them in their first pre-season outing. Another good run out for Yamis. Yeah, 